Superman Returns and it is as great as ever. We really are getting such great storytelling across the board with Superman and Lois. I am so excited the show is back. I honestly dreaded Tuesdays because this show was not on because of the Olympics. But it, it's really come back strong. You got the whole alley situation with the whole pendant and how it gives people visions into, the, I guess, the bizarro realm uh, world. I'm not sure exactly how they're doing this, but it's so interesting to see and have it unfold the way they have it going. That's interesting. It, the, the characters and having it very much character driven is so fantastic. Superman taking on Bizarro, that action scene, that whole thing in the warehouse was amazing. Watching Superman realize that he is Bizarro is basically the is the exact opposite. You got a fire breath and freeze vision and seeing him realize that and then taking him to the mine and just beating him up was fantastic to see across the board seeing how lois's partner in crime with the whole newspaper basically get drugged by ally was such a twist well it was a twist but it was also not a twist like i didn't think she was gonna drug her i thought she was gonna be more of just joining the cult in a way but holy cow what a way to really start an episode fantastic you have oh you have jonathan taking those drugs and just seeing these different subplots across the episode and how they're kind of interwoven with one another superman with the whole department of defense like everything is kind of woven together storylines are starting to cross over to make it one strong narrative across the board and that's really exciting to see. Way back when I thought Superman was fight, gonna fight Doomsday, I was cautious with where we're going, but I am so confident in the writers of this show. The cinematography is excellent. The writing is excellent. And honestly, the dialogue has gotten really good. Even a lot of people complained about the whole CWS with the, with the teenagers. Honestly, I don't mind it. it. It's not bad. And honestly, it's so much better than what we really get on the CW that, yeah, some moments can be like, ooh, cringe. But at the same time, so many things are impactful. They develop the characters. I mean, the whole dr Jonathan with the drugs and all with the, with the kryptonite, like that is going to be such an interesting storyline. The more and more it develops general lang training the boys like that again like all these things are going to be so interesting overall this episode it it, it honestly was a fantastic kind of premiere in a way because we've been gone for two weeks it pulls people back in it honestly by having so many little subplots that honestly did not feel like we had a million subplots in one episode it was a nice way to remind everyone the different moments and everything that the story has been telling for the season and get everyone caught up to where we are now. I give this episode a eight and a half out of 10. It was strong. Was it the best? No, but it was a strong, strong, strong bring back of Superman and Lois. Let me know down in the comments what you thought of the episode. What do you think of the whole bizarro situation we have going on right now? And I would love for you to join me on this journey across Superman and Lois and all the other shows we cover here on the channel. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys later.